Hello, in this video I'm going to teach you how to make your code look more beautiful and much more readable. If you look at this, it's a little bit too many parentheses for, for my taste. It looks a little bit like jQuery. And uh, if you have uh, five buttons on an activity, you you probably it will be hard to debug it. So what you do, what we're gonna do just write on Google butter knife Android and um, the first result should give you to this page. Now pause the video, read everything that's on this page and uh, we'll continue after. Okay, so how to use butter knife? You just inject the view immediately after uh, you you declare your activity. You use uh, it to in instantiate butter knife here on on create, and after that you can um, you can perform different things like um, specify something that will be automatically be be done uh, at one click on this this button. Um, button knife is a really great library. I, um, I discovered it later and uh, I've been using it ever since. And it's important for you to start programming by using it because it will, it will make your life much more easier in the future. So how to, to import it? You see it has a Gradle project and it says just let's just copy this here. Also tells you to press lint warnings for invalid package. Let's put it here. Let's click sync. Um later you want to to um, configure ProGuard ProGuard 2. But uh, this will learn at a later stage. Okay, so now that we've imported butter knife in our project, let's modify this button so it uses butter knife. So right here we just call inject view, and uh, we have to give them. RID of the button and we have to specify the name of the button and always remember to to put it here at on create Tight after the set content view. Let's go ahead and import it. And we don't need this anymore. And from here we just need this part. Let's, let's delete it. And um, we will create here you start with add on click and um, you see here uh, an, uh, an example let's make it uh, and here inside we put our alert. So notice how much more cleaner our um, application has become and it will look much more cleaner once you, we have lots of controls uh, inside, inside our activity. Let's test it. And we 
achieve the same result as our previous previous uh, code but now the lo code looks much more cleaner and much more easier to be debugged now butter knife doesn't support only on click it uh, if we take a look um, by pressing control and space we see ports a uh, lot of things on touch on text change on on lots of things for example on we we should put uh, let's try with on long click and um, we see you have an error here it says on, lo uh, on long click message might have a boolean return type so let's transform this function into a boolean to return a boolean and um, yeah butter knife is is really a savior because um, just makes the code much more cleaner here you go on long long click is, is activated now the homework it's uh, really simple add two more buttons into this uh, uh, screen instantiate them with butter knife and display a message uh, if you click on any of them a different message it's a really simple homework and uh, I hope you you will do it okay